On December 23rd, 962 AD, the Imperial Army of the Eastern Roman Empire stormed the city of Aleppo and sacked it for several days. Aleppo was captured by the Hamnadid dynasty back in 944 AD, and the new rulers made the city their capital. And for the next two decades, Aleppo flourished into a metropolis. The Eastern Romans and the Hamnadids fought over the borderlands of East Anatolia for the next 20 years. The rivalry between the Orthodox Christians and the Muslim nations was a brutal one, each empire trying to assert its domination over the region. The Hamnadids, for the first decade, had the advantage in defeating the Eastern Romans in battle until 960 AD when Nicephorus Phocas, a brilliant general who was promoted the commander-in-chief of the Antolia frontier. Nicephorus assembled a dream team of lieutenant generals, which included his brother Leo and nephew John. The trio set off to crush the Hamdanids. While Nicephorus was retaking the island of Crete, his brother Leo defeated the Hamdanids at the Battle of Andrasos on November 9, 960 AD, when they set up an ambush near the province of Cappadocia, which was a target by the Hamnidids for a large-scale invasion. In 961 AD, Nicephorus marched his soldiers eastward on a search-and-destroy mission to create a barrier between the Eastern Roman Empire and the Hamnidids. Essentially, a no-man's land was created near the eastern frontier between the two nations. In 962 AD, Nicephorus planned a total conquest of the Aleppo region by capturing nearby towns and destroying them while slowly creeping into their territory. Before they marched on to Aleppo, Nicephorus negotiated a faux peace treaty, luring the Hamdanids into a false sense of peace and security. The Hamdanids also felt that they were safe from an attack because the Eastern Romans never waged war during the holy month of December. On December 22, 962 AD, a large Eastern Roman army led by Nicephorus marched on to the outskirts of Aleppo and besieged the city. The Hamdanid army only had a few thousand soldiers garrisoned in Aleppo Citadel, while the invaders reportedly numbered in the tens of thousands. After spending the day trying to fend off and invading eastern Romans, the Hamdanid defensive lines broke, and the large invading army stormed into Aleppo on December 23rd and looted the city, carrying away priceless valuables and plunder. The Eastern Roman army sacked the city for several days, destroying most of the new buildings and fortifications the Muslim occupiers built during their residency in Aleppo. When the Eastern Romans finally left, they took over 10,000 prisoners along with nearly 400,000 silver dinars along with a lot of plunder. When a relief army from the Hamdanids entered Aleppo after the sack ended, they found a ruined and depopulated city.